How's it going, everybody? I'm Nikki Delventhal, and this is my dog, Camper Delventhal. We live in this four-wheel Tacoma pop-up camper, and we're here to take you along on the wild ride. Woo! So fasten up your seatbelts and let's have some fun. Don't forget, if you like what you see, like, subscribe, comment, share with your friends and turn on notifications. Camper and I would be so thankful. On last week's episode, Camper and I make our way through Idaho. In an attempt to dodge the wildfires surrounding the area, we go wild camping deep in the mountains. Here we enjoy our time completely off grid, going hiking to multiple alpine lakes, take in the nature, seek out some more lakes to enjoy, and even meet up with our best friend Lauren in a nearby town. It was a blast, but we leave off needing to leave as the wildfires began to spread. There are wildfires surrounding this area, and although we were hoping that the smoke in the air would subside this week, it seems to be getting worse and worse. So today we're gonna continue our journey west and hopefully get out of that a little bit. And we gotta make a couple stops along the way. Welcome to Oregon. All right, first stop, grocery shopping. Oh my goodness, camper. This is the Walmart that we got kicked out of for trying to sleep in uh, last year. <laughs> How funny, I totally forgot about that. Uh, oh, reminiscing on the good times. At least now they have signs up that say no overnight parking. Before they did not. All right, we are fully stocked and ready to go. We got everything we need for at least a couple weeks, I think. Um, one of the most valuable things that I've learned in my, gosh, I think it's been seven or eight years of full-time travel and most of that being completely solo, is the value of being comfortable being alone. Uh, right here, lady. What I mean by that is learning that you don't need to look to other people or other things to make you happy, that you are fully enough by yourself. Uh, that's one of my favorite things that I've learned in this time. But another thing that I've learned is the value of community and genuine human connection. I think that's something that all of us need and something that we can really be missing in a lifestyle like this, where you're just passing through towns and moving around a lot. You know, I could choose to stay alone in the woods right now if that's what I needed, but right now I really feel like I need some human connection. So I'm gonna do something that I've never done before. There is a group of people who have been caravanning together for quite a while now. They all live out of their vans and they invited me to join them. Uh, I've actually never met any of them before, so I'm a little bit nervous, but I don't know, I think it's gonna be really fun. So I'm just gonna put myself out there and it could be one of the best things I ever did. I don't know, let's see how it goes. All right, I see one van. Oh, I see a lot of vans. This is definitely it. Hey! Isn't this dope? What? Hi, friends! Hi. What's up? <laughs> Group hug! <laughs> <laughs> Yay! I'm so happy! Group hug! Hi, everybody! Hi! <laughs> nice to meet you guys! Millie wants in. Oh, uh, thanks for having me, you guys. I'm so happy. Okay, so. Alright, it is time for the setup. What a warm welcome. Uh, all right, we are just going to go ahead and uh, set ourselves up here and go hang out with the group. Mm -hmm. 
Everyone here is a YouTuber or a content creator of some sort, and it's been really cool to see everyone with their cameras out, really just using their creativity and seeing how they work. Uh, I have really been enjoying this and everyone is so nice. All right, it is dinner time at the campsite. Everyone is going to their vans and cooking, so I don't know. Camper, what are we having for dinner tonight? You're lying if you say you don't take clumps of shredded cheese and eat it in the middle of the night. <laughs> you are a Neanderthal. For camper. Oh, that one looked beefier. <gasps> oh, that's the good stuff. What we are trying to do here is doing as little dishes as possible. So we have our utensil and we have our bowl. <laughs> Freaking perfect. All right, let's get back out there. All right, here we go. Okay, ready? <laughs> He says... That worked a perfect bite. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna do a uh, little impromptu shower here. We're gonna heat up some water. Mm, it feels good. Hot. Oh, ah. Ho, ho, ho. That's hot. Could have used the water heater in the faucet, but this just felt right. Okay, we're gonna shower. I have four toothbrushes all over this vehicle because I often lose those along with forks. So now I have a spoon fork. Maybe I beat the system. <laughs> Good morning, camper. Hi, baby. I should make a boy. Big stretch.
All right, guys, while we wait for the sun to poke out over these trees, I'm gonna go ahead and set up my solar panels and connect them to my Jackery portable power station. Uh, if you've been following along for a while, you know I'm a long time user. If I'm not charging it up on long car drives or on an electrical outlet, I'm charging it up directly through the sun, which is what we're doing today. This is my favorite thing about the station because no matter where I am, I can have power as long as there is sunlight. So once the sun hits these babies, I am going to be completely charged up in hours and that makes life on the road so much easier. I highly recommend having a power station, not just for off grid, but also for at home during power outages and emergencies. If you would like one for yourself, please use the link in my description as it really helps out Camper and I, but also I have a huge discount in the description for you. Let's go ahead and change and move our car into a shaded area. It's gonna be a hot one. Oh, right. Alrighty then, it's a two cup kind of morning. Should clean that up a little better. It's a two cup kind of morning. It's a two cup kind of day. We're gonna grind our own bean. Oh, you're a mess. You're a mess, darling. It's a two cup kind of morning. It's a two cup kind of day. This is gonna take a while. Put some abs in. That was a black belt in Taekwondo, in case you couldn't tell. It's one of my favorite things ever. Fresh grinds. Just how I like them. Alright, we're gonna pour this over the sink because we always miss. And today we are gonna use our noggins. Oh yeah. Perfect pour. No sweat. Lots of sweat. There's gonna be a lot of sweat today. It's gonna be 97 degrees. <laughs> so. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake your milk, yeah. Shake your milk, yeah. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake your booty. Shake your booty. <sighs> shake, shake. Mm. Nicole, you have outdone yourself. Wow. Hey, my dude. All right, somebody has an immense amount of energy, so I think we're gonna take a little bike ride before it gets too hot out. One of my favorite things to do is gravel bike up and down these dirt roads. Uh, not only because it's great exercise for me and camper, but also it's a great way to scope out new camp spots. Some of the best camp spots I've ever found have been by a gravel bike. Woo. Oh crikey, here we are coming up on some influences in the wild. I heard if you pass them, you instantly go viral. Let's try it out. Hello, everyone. Hello. Hello. Let's hit it. Come on, Cam. Woo! I think it worked. I think we went viral. Ah, 
You did so good. Good job. Let's go. We've worked up quite the appetite. It's time to eat. That's good. All right, we are all just hanging out, avoiding any energy exertion uh, to beat the heat. <laughs> so, yeah, a whole lot of nothing today. I love it. I needed that. Just kidding. It's getting hot. We're going to go seek out some water. See how this goes. Looks pretty shallow. <laughs> oh, I can't feel my feet. It burns. Oh. Oh. I pulled oh, off burns. instantly. Ah! Oh, I can't lay down. You can do it. You can do it. You gotta do it now. Yes, you can. Let's do it. Let's go. Ah! Look at you. <laughs> Just roll. Ah! Yeah, yeah, roll around. <laughs> that is freezing. Yeah. Are we washing our armpits now? It's a good idea. I smell real bad. Oh, I'm not hot anymore. Like I'm I don't cold. Doubt it. Yeah. It feels good. Like an ice cube. Yeah. I don't smell anymore either. Ooh. <laughs> So much better. All right, so now that we cooled off in the river, it is time to get hot. Uh, apparently we're doing this thing called hot shot, hot one, something with hot sauce. I do not do hot sauce. I can't even do black pepper in my food. So needless to say, this is gonna be fun or terrible. I'm not sure, but I got some vegan nuggets at Walmart a couple days ago. Nuggets! So let's go make them for all the vegans. What are you holding? This is the last dab. It is made out of the Apollo pepper, which is the spiciest pepper in the world. Uh, I wanted to wear a red shirt, but I don't own any red shirts. So I wore a red scrunchie power move and beat all these suckers. <laughs> Mind over matter, baby. I'm not really sure if this is a competition actually. Hold on, we're recording. Hold on. Let's go, let's go. But we're doing this thing. We're doing this. <laughs> Hi everyone and welcome to Van Life Hot Ones where we <laughs> where you get to watch all your favorite van lifers throw up in about 60 minutes. There you go, there you go. We're about to eat some spicy vegan friendly tendies. Each bowl here has increasingly hotter tendies. And as we progress through the night, I don't know. We'll see. Let's do it. Let's do this. Okay, so this is level one here. I just want to add that Nikki thinks black pepper is hot. So <laughs> Are we eating this whole thing? Yes, yeah. you're eating the okay. whole thing. Oh. Cheers. Cheers. Yay. This is not hot. Hot. Let's okay, let's That's too much. We put too much on the top. <laughs> Spicy ass. Oh! We're bonding together. I'm dying, dude. <laughs> I will never do that again in my life. 
Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends and turn on notifications. And if you'd like all of our videos early access and during that time completely ad free, join our Patreon for as low as $1 a month. Have a great day. We love you all. We are all just both <laughs> So even if you make it past the initial yeah, surge, so you know, there's round two an hour later. Good luck. Well, I'm so glad I joined you guys this is the, on this, this, is, this is before. <laughs>